Hi, welcome to Skylight. Today we are going to talk about time billing and invoicing. How to send billable time from your projects to the invoice and how to send that invoice to the client. So let's get started. The best way to generate an invoice for the billable time is to do it from the project itself. On the project we have 19.5 hours log. To build this simply hover over and click on the invoice. On the next view you have few customizable options. The first section is where you specify contact information for the invoice. Second section is about whether you want this data for the new invoice or an existing one. And the third most important section of this view is grouping your data by headings and line items. Any changes in this section will reflect how your line items will look on the final invoice. Let's go through these options so that you can understand them in a bit more detail. The first section defines who the invoice is for. Skylight will automatically pick your client contact from your project. You can also add a new contact right here in this view. You can type an existing contact's name and pick it from the drop-down list. The attention of list will show any contacts that are related to the contact above. This is great if you want to send this invoice to a company but mark it for the attention of someone at that company. Next section along defines where you want to send this log time to a new invoice or an existing one. For the new invoice you have further options to use accounting templates covered in a separate video and also import project tags so your invoices and projects can have the same tag and tag groups. The next section is customize and group. This is a cool feature of Skylight that allows you to group your billable data by tasks, task lists, resource, roles and more. Also when you change the settings here, they are reflected on the preview panel. As you can see, the line items here just contain start and end times and dates. This sometimes is not sufficient to send clients invoices with all the time logs. Therefore we allow you to group your time logs by tasks, roles and many other options available in the customized panel. For instance, if I select tasks in the heading section, the time logs group themselves based on which task they were logged on. Similarly, you could try task list and roles. On the right hand panel, all your time logs are grouped by task list and roles. You could do the same thing with the line items as well. Underneath this section, you have saved configuration option where you can save your settings so you can recall them for later use. Once you're happy with your configurations and the way your invoice line items look, head down the page and press save. On the top of the invoice preview, you can see the PayPal option. Your clients can pay for the invoice by PayPal or credit card and debit cards. Below that is your invoice with the invoice headers, which are customizable in your business settings, invoice details, and invoice line items. At the top of the invoice you have options to download PDF, edit and also send. So let's go and send this invoice. On the email message view you have subject populated with the invoice and project details. Recipients field is already populated. In this case the client is already added and you can add more contacts here as well. In the message body below, Skylight adds a special link that your clients can click to view the invoice without having to log into Skylight. Below the message body is an option to CC yourself, attach other files. Skylight automatically adds a PDF of this invoice to the message as well. To send the message, just press save and your message will be on its way. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please connect with us on Facebook and Twitter.